unusual to be a corgi in a backpack. It's not unusual to be a doggo in a backpack. Hello, 10 days to the ride. Actually, in, in, in uh, a week from now, I'm gonna be in Northern California. I'm flying up actually Saturday night <clears throat> to go hang out, rest up, eat well. I didn't go riding this morning because, uh, I don't know, I felt really good yesterday kind of slept in, whatever. Uh, usually though, after Sunday ride, I will end up at Gorilla Tacos, which is what I'm gonna go do now. I went to La Isla Bonita instead. I forgot that um, Abikini was um, like their Abikini festival today. So that was kind of a shit show. This is much better. I take that back. I mean, it's like apples and oranges, but this is also one of my favorites. Jesus. It's a much better experience since there aren't a million people around. That's what I meant. I mean, those weren't exactly the tacos I wanted, but they're not the worst tacos I've ever had. I mean, they're some of the better tacos that, that I've had in my life. Noodle. Hey, yeah, there you go. Hmm? Noodle. Yeah, so today, uh, I actually didn't ride today. I mean, I rode like six miles today. That doesn't even count. Um, I did have a 20 pound corgi on my back. This one, this one, I had this one on my back. Um, yeah. Yeah, so I, I didn't go ride today. I guess that needs a little bit more explanation. I. I was up late last night working on stuff. You know, I haven't really had many weekends. It's family stuff I've been trying to take care of and just, but you know, writing takes like, it's like five or six hours a day on Saturday and Sunday. And then, you know, you don't have much of a day left. So I'm cramming to get stuff done before next. Uh, next Saturday when I take off, so, yeah. So, uh, I need to go pick up, I need to go pick up my laundry, and then I usually go, like, drop by Mission Workshop. Anyway. Yeah. I say I was gonna do today. Probably didn't get anything done that I was meant to. <clears throat> Stuff around the house. It's just it's been so fucking busy. There we go. Wipe down some shit. Any flares? Hello. Good afternoon. I'm on a dog walk. I'm always on a dog walk. Noodle. Come on, Noodle. Noodle.
those dogs are gonna eat you. September 25th, 8 a.m. Nine days left for the ride. Guess what I'm doing? She's worth it. I don't know, very minimal riding this week. Gonna let these legs rest up a little bit. Um, maybe do some easy spinning. But, um, yeah, you know, I'm just gonna get ready for the ride. Um, you know, pack up, buy all the things that I need to buy, like tubes and nutrition and, you know, all that kind of stuff. Why am I looking over here? So I'm walking to lunch. I'm gonna have an impossible burger at Mommy. These things are so good. So good. You know. Not a lot of people work today, so uh, I am going to, uh, you know, have a wee little lunch. You know, you know how you do. building twice every day. Twice. Uh, on the way to work. And on the way home. And that is the Bridgestone RB1 and it's awesome. I want to be her friend. Anyhow, the reason I point out this building is that one day I was driving past it and I noticed that it's a groom associates on the outside which is where my mom used to work and I remember being here like when I was a little kid like the first time she ever took me into her office and they were on Epcot Center they had all this cool futuristic you know Epcot Center shit and I think maybe that's why I thought what work was gonna be like. You know, having cool futuristic shit everywhere. And coming to work on um, Saturdays and having to bring your kid in, but you know, whatever. But yeah, I mean, so weird. I never put two and two together. I drove by this place for months. 